Synergy Application Note 139, Synergy Manager. This is Johnny Rogoff for Tidal Engineering Corporation. I'm here to introduce Synergy Manager, the software application we designed to simplify environmental test chamber and process oven management, including remote control, programming, and logging, by providing a single environment that supports more than a dozen different process controllers and hundreds of configurations. To give you a quick demo of Synergy Manager, I will connect my Synergy Nano controller and remotely operate and program it. I will go through these steps in detail later in this video. Once the connection is established, I can remotely control and monitor my controller using Synergy Manager. With its Write Once, Run Anywhere philosophy, Synergy Manager improves productivity because labs only need to write a program once no matter how many different controllers they might need to run it on. From the chamber window, I can open a program. Here is an example of what the program looks like graphically. I will now download the profile. I go to Profile Control and load the profile. Once the profile is loaded, I press Start. I go to the program screen on the controller and I can see it is on Step 2. I can hold and resume the program and with WebTouch Remote, I can see the program is paused. I can also stop the program and dial in manual set points. Tidal Engineering's Synergy controllers, including the Quarter DIN Synergy Nano, the Synergy Micro 2, and the Synergy Quattro, provide state-of-the-art usability and connectivity for environmental test control and data acquisition. They combine the functions of a chamber controller and a data logger. They are designed to improve test efficiency by supporting both factory automation and test and measurement protocols and standards. Offering the flexibility of multiple communication ports, including Ethernet, GPIB, and RS-232, makes these controllers perfect for today's changing test environments. Now that I've shown some of the features and benefits of Synergy Manager, I'll demonstrate the setup and operation in more detail. To follow along, you can download Synergy Manager from our download page at www.tidalemg.com download.htm. As I mentioned for this demo, I'm connecting to my Synergy Nano using an Ethernet TCP IP connection. After you run the Synergy Manager for the first time, you begin by defining a port to specify the details of each connection you want to use to connect your chambers and ovens. I click the Ports menu, then scroll over Port Setup, and click Define a Port. Once the Port box pops up, I click Next to begin the setup. I choose the Ethernet TCP IP option and then click Next. I enter the IP address of my Synergy controller and then hit Next again. I have now created my first port and the port details are listed. I click Finish and the message at the bottom of the window indicates a successful port definition. Next, I define a chamber for each system from the Define a Chamber menu. I start by clicking Next and then give my system a name. I like to keep it simple, so I will call it Chamber, and then, since I'm using an Ethernet connection, add the last octet of my controller's IP address. For the description, I'll use Temp Humidity Nano and click Next. I choose the Versa 10.5 Synergy option and hit Next. I pick the Temp Humidity option and hit Next, and then hit the Ethernet TCP IP option and hit Next again. I click the Ethernet port from the list to review the chamber configuration. Since all the information is correct, I click Finish. The message at the bottom tells me that I have successfully defined my first chamber with Synergy Manager. To load the chamber that I created, I click the Chambers menu and click on the name of the chamber. The chamber window will pop up with the chamber name in the title bar. I then click the Connect button. Since I see the information for my Synergy controller coming in, I know that Synergy Manager has connected to the chamber. From the chamber window, I can access the Profile Editor by clicking the Profile tab and hitting the Start Profile Editor button. From here, I can save, open, and create new profiles, as well as add steps to the profile, set step parameters, and graph the profile for a quick visual check. To add my first step, I click the Ramp button. Note that I can use the Ramp step to ramp up, ramp down, or soak at a constant temperature or condition.
I add the set point for channel 1, and to change my channel 2 set point, I click the control button and then type in my set point. I then click the ramp time tab and set the amount of time I want the step to ramp for. Then click apply and my parameters for the step are set. As I mentioned before, one of the benefits of Synergy Manager is that it can store all of the test programs for a factory or lab on a single computer or server. Once I create a profile with Synergy Manager, I can then download it to one or many process ovens or chambers. To demonstrate profile download, I go to my Synergy Nano Chamber window and click the Profiles tab. I click Download Profile and select the profile and the download starts. Once the profile has downloaded, I click Profile Control, then Load. Now I can remotely start, pause, and resume this profile using Synergy Manager. Here is a profile I created on Synergy Manager. As you can see, there are a number of ramp steps, a loop step, and a stop step. The loop step specifies jump to line 1 and a jump count of 3. Synergy Manager can show me a graph of the profile so I can quickly check the profile is as I expect. The controller goes through the first thermal cycle and jumps back three times for a total of four cycles. With the full version of Synergy Manager, customers with a Synergy controller or any of the other supported controllers including Versa 10.2, 3, 4, or 5, Wattlow 942 and F4, Thermatron 4800, and Yokogawa 550 and 750 can create, edit, download, and control profiles. As a bonus for customers with titles Synergy Controllers, the free version of Synergy Manager can read and write profiles in the native Synergy Controller file format, so profile creation and editing can be accomplished on the desktop. These files can then be transferred to your controller via a thumb drive or using the FTP server built into each controller. Thank you for watching. For more information about Synergy Manager and for the download, please see www.tidaleng.com/synergyman.htm on our website.